begin. Basically, we want to start with our feet spread shoulder width apart. So if you're new to, if you're used to yoga, usually the stance is a bit more narrower. But we want to take our feet a little bit wider and make sure those toes are pointing forward. Okay. Now let's place the very center of one hand just below the navel, about a centimeter or two, and then take the very center of the other hand and place it on the back of the other hand. Good. Now we begin to relax into our standing posture by the bending the knees just a little bit. And we drop that tailbone down as you lift the front of the pelvic bone up. So you feel that length in the lower back. Good. Now relax the ankles, the knees and the hips. And let's begin to focus on our breath first. So let's close our eyes and begin to turn all of our attention within ourselves. Now, as you inhale, let that belly expand out like a balloon away from the body. And each time you exhale, that belly gently moves back towards your spine. So begin to gently slow the breath down a bit longer and a bit deeper. Our Qigong is energy work. So our intention here is to move the energy with our movement and our breath. And this is a beautiful moving meditation, very gentle, very peaceful. So we want to relax as much as possible. We bring a gentle smile to the face. This is part of the practice because that smile sends a message to your brain and body to relax. And a moment of gratitude for this beautiful day, this beautiful morning. Let's gently open the eyes and relax the arms at the sides. We're going to start with a gentle spinal twist. So very slowly looking over to the side and all the way behind, keeping those knees bent as we go to the other side, nice and slow, looking all the way behind, beginning to warm up the spine. So take your time and connect to your breath. The entire practice, we are connected to our breath. Nice, slow inhale into the belly and nice, slow exhale now out through the mouth. So as we inhale, we fill the body with energy. And as we exhale through the mouth, we purge, we release any toxins or stress. Now, when you feel comfortable, you can start to go a little bit more freely side to side, the arms completely relaxed. And your choice, you can keep the eyes open or closed. I like to close the eyes sometimes and just look within, staying connected to the breath. Gentle, big inhale through the nose, all the way to the belly. And each exhale is out through the mouth. And we bring the mind into the spine. Wherever your mind goes, the energy flows. So we use the mind to guide the energy with the focus, the concentration of the mind. And after you warm up a bit, if you feel like going a bit stronger, you can, but you can stay gentle if you like. And make sure to look over each shoulder to lead the twist, keeping those knees gently bent. And this is a great way to start every morning. It only takes a minute or two. You already get the blood flowing. You're doing your deep breathing and you're warming up the spine to get you ready for the rest of the day. So there's no excuse that you can't get ready for the day. You don't have time for yoga practice. You definitely have time for a minute or two of this. And it automatically starts to get that energy flowing. Very gently and slowly unwinding back to the center. Come back to stillness. The knees are gently bent. The pelvic bone in the front is lifting as the tailbone sinks. And the arms are out to the sides just a bit. 
the chin tucking back a little bit, back of the neck long. And let's take a deep, relaxing breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. <sighs> Good. Now we begin to gently bounce. We're going to massage the whole body with the bouncing movement. And again, it's big inhale through the nose all the way to the belly and exhale through the mouth. So we're shaking out any tension and try to remember to keep those feet facing forward. So the feet are really parallel, shoulder width apart. <sighs> and it's okay to make sound. It's good to let that tension out. It's good to have a little smile on the face. The more sound you let out, the better you feel actually. So don't be shy. <sighs> let everything relax. You're massaging your internal organs. You're massaging your joints, your connective tissue. And imagine you're sending stress and toxins down into the earth and our beautiful mother earth will recycle it and turn it into flowers. So just shake it out. We'll do about a minute of this. This really gets the energy going. Let's go with the tension. If you like, you can shake the hands out a little bit. Open those wrist joints. Keep breathing. We'll take it out to the sides. Up overhead. And back down. Now we take an inhale, lift the hands up. Exhale. Two more. Last one. A few more bounces. Now nice and slow, come back to stillness. Let's all close our eyes, knees gently bent, and take that deep, relaxing breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. And just look within and feel the effects of your practice. Very nice. Now let's continue to warm the body for the practice. So as we inhale, lift the arms up. As we exhale, come all the way down into the squat as low as you can. Grab the energy of the earth. Inhale, draw it up through the body. Release it to the sky. Exhale. Then back down. Now let's inhale all the way up. Exhale. Inhale as you come down. Grab that energy of the earth. Draw it up through the body. Inhale up. Come on down. Draw it up. Good. Keep going. Find your own rhythm, what works best for you. So inhale up. Then you can inhale down and exhale here. Take another inhale, whatever breath works best for you. But we want to try to draw that energy up through the body. Now we can do the tiger. So as you exhale down, stick the tongue out. This is purifying. Inhale up. Good. Inhale up. A few more times. Last one. Inhale up. And exhale, float the hands down. Now let's bring those hands over the center of the navel. Gently bend the knees, lift the pubic bone in the front, sink the tailbone down, relax the shoulders. Let's return that gentle breath all the way into the navel. So as you inhale, gently expand the belly. And as you exhale, belly back to spine. Take your time, slowing the breath down. As we close the eyes, we look within. All meditation is just focusing on the present experience. And we close the eyes and connect to the breath. We are connecting to the present. Good. Let's open our eyes and move into what's called the eight pieces of silk brocade. These are eight flowing movements. And I'll show you first, then we'll do them together. We can do it very gently. 
So once again, just make sure you get your stance in the right position, feet shoulder width apart, gentle bend in the knees. We'll place the hands here to begin. Good, let's take a deep inhale together. Nice slow exhale through the mouth. As you inhale, turn the palms up, turn them over at the face, reach to the sky, press the palms flat, look up, and then bring the head back to the center then exhale, gently float the hands down, bent at the elbows. Let's all do it together. Inhale, turn at the face, press up, look up, really flex those wrists as we hold the breath for a moment, then head back to the front and through the mouth, exhale. Slowly bend the knees a bit as you come down. As you inhale, rise up with the breath, turn the hands to the sky, press the sky up, looking up to the hands, bring the face forward again, and exhale through the mouth. Nice, bending the knees. Inhale, rise up. Press the palms up, hold that breath. You're opening the lungs here. Turn the face forward and exhale down. Now connect to the energy. As you inhale, you're drawing the energy of the earth up through the body, pressing it to the sky. Hold that breath in. Turn the face forward through the mouth. Exhale, release. So just get into the flow. Inhale up, hold the breath for a moment, reach as you press the sky up, bring the face forward, exhale through the mouth. Good, inhale, rise, face forward, exhale, release. Now try the last three on your own time. Nice and gentle. Everything is gentle. We want to try to keep the body relaxed, except at the top where we are pushing. Then we release. Let that energy flow. Last time. Exhale. Now as you inhale, bring the hands up to the top of the chest. Come up onto the toes. And as you exhale, sink the heels down, press the energy down, and bring the hands over just below the navel. This energy center is called the lower Dantian, and this is the battery of our being. So we always come back to this place of stability and power. Return that breath gently to the lower Dantian, the lower abdomen. Yeah, now let's take a big, wide open stance to the right. And now we can turn the toes out to about 45 degrees. We're going to do what's called the archer. I'll demonstrate first. If your legs get tired, and they might, you can come back up. But we'll stay down and keep those knees pointing out, not in. We're going to take the right hand across. Now, like the archer pulls back the string of a bow, you see my hand like you're pulling that bow string. One finger pulling back, thumb facing up. The other hand is pressing forward in that position. So we're opening the chest here. We inhale here and we hold for a moment. Pull that elbow back, feel that stretch. Then we're gonna exhale, float the hand across and do the same thing to the other side. Inhale, hold for a moment. And you can see my fingers are straight and these fingers, thumb up, pulling that bowstring back. Okay, so let's begin. Hands here. And if you get tired, it's okay. Come back up when you're ready. Now, begin, we bring that right arm across the front, then inhale, pull it back, left hand reaches, open the chest, then through the mouth, exhale, sweep that left arm over the front, then inhale, pull the bow back, hold for just a moment, through the mouth, exhale, release the hand floating across the front of the body, then inhale to the other side, hold for just a moment, Exhale, float the left hand over the front of the body. Inhale, open. Good, exhale, release. Float the hand across the front and inhale back. Hold and exhale through the mouth. Float the hand over the front, inhale back. Good, exhale, release. Float the hand over, inhale, open. Feel that stretch in the chest. Exhale, release, hand to the front, and inhale back. Good, last round, exhale to the side, inhale, open. One more time on the other side to finish, and exhale across, 
Inhale, open. Then exhale, step the feet, shoulder width apart, bring the hands down. Inhale, come up on the toes, hands to the top of the chest, and exhale down. Let's bring the hands over the lower Dantian, just below the navel. Knees are gently bent. Lift that pubic bone up, sink the tailbone down. Close the eyes and come back to the breath. Slowing the breath down. And we keep coming back to this energy center that's just behind the navel, inside of the body, in front of the spine. And as we breathe, we feel that we're filling that center with breath and energy, just behind the navel, in front of the spine. Good. Now let's open the eyes and go into our next practice. I'll demonstrate first. So this time we're going to take the right arm up and we're going to flex that wrist. So we're pressing up and the left hand is also flexing, but we pull that back. We inhale up and we twist over to the side, looking behind, hold that breath in all the way, coming back to the front. Then we exhale, hands down in front of the Dantian and other side, inhale up. So we flex both wrists, this one pulling back a bit, and we turn to the side, looking behind. And as we hold the breath, we come back to the front, then we exhale through the mouth. Okay, so let's start with the hands here. Now listen to my instructions. As we inhale, right arm up, your right arm. Press this palm down. So the first one we'll do nice and slow, fingers face forward. Yep. Good. Now turn to the side. Don't worry about the breath for this moment. So open to the side that's not the arm up, the opposite side, and look behind you. So you're twisting the spine. Then you come back to the front and release. Hands down, other side, left arm up. That's it, flex that hand, yes. Then open to the side, look behind you, and come back to the front and release down. Good, now we're gonna do it with the breath. Inhale, arm up, hold that breath in, stretch, Turn to the side, look behind you, and come back to the front while you're holding the breath. Exhale through the mouth, nice and slow, hands down. Inhale, other side, open, turn, holding that breath in. Come back to the center, holding the breath in, through the mouth, exhale, release. Good, bend down, then rise up. Hold the breath in, turn. Hold the breath in, back to front. Through the mouth, exhale, release. Good, inhale, rise up, stretch, open the lungs, turn behind, hold the breath in, come back to the front, through the mouth, exhale, release. Good, a few more times, inhale up, open, stretch, twist to the side, holding the breath in, keep that breath in as we come back to the front, and exhale, bend the knees a little bit, good, inhale, rise up, Stretch as you twist, hold that breath in as we come back to the front, and exhale down. Good, last time on each side, inhale up. Hold the breath in, twist, look behind. Come back to the front, exhale, release. Last time on this side, last time all together. Hold the breath, twist, hold the breath back to the front. And exhale, release, hands down just below. And we always end this way. Inhale, rise up onto the toes, hands to the top of the chest. And exhale, gently float the hands back over the center just below the navel. Bend the knees a little bit, lift the pelvic bone, drop the tailbone down so you feel that length in the lower back. And come back to the breath here, back to the center of power. Inhale, belly expands. Exhale, belly to spine. Now let's open our eyes. Now we're going to do what's called Wise Owl Looks Backwards. So they have very poetic names for their movements in Qigong. Now we're gonna imagine we're holding a big grapefruit or a huge doorknob, and we're gonna keep our fingers in this curled position the whole time. We want to keep the wrists 
mostly straight. So we're not bending the wrists, we're keeping them straight. So I'll show you first. We're gonna start here. And as we inhale, keeping those wrists straight, fingers bent, we gently open the chest and look to the side. We wanna lift the chin. We wanna to try to keep the chin parallel to the floor as you look behind and turn those eyes as far as you can. The movement of the eyes impacts your consciousness, impacts your mind. And as we exhale, we rotate the hands, backs of the hands towards each other. We lift the pubic bone and we round the back, chin towards the chest. So you're opening the back. You can feel that here. You don't need to touch the hands. You just bring them close. Then you'll do it to the other side. Same thing, open and back. So you're opening the front, you're opening the back, and this is opening what are called energy channels that open the different organs or connect to the different organs of the body. So let's bring the hands here. Start with the holding those big grapefruits and we'll turn the backs of the hands towards each other. Gentle bend in the knees, feet facing forward, feet hip width apart. Good. As you inhale, rise up, look to your right, twist the hands up and back. And as you exhale through the mouth, bend the knees a little bit, chin towards the chest, round the back, rotate the back of the hands towards each other. Now inhale, open to the other side, open. Nice big inhale, hold for a moment. When you're ready, now exhale, chin to the chest, round the back, tuck the tailbone down, that's it. So inhale, open. So try to do this without too much tension through the movement. At the end, there's a little stretch. Exhale through the mouth, back to the center, and inhale, open. Lift that chest, and exhale. Round the back, chin towards the chest. Feel that opening in the back, and inhale. Remember that smile, it sends a message to the brain to relax. It actually helps you feel better. And inhale to the other side. Feel that nice opening in the chest. Exhale through the mouth as we come back to the center. Tuck the tailbone, chin towards the chest, and inhale. Good. Every time we exhale through the mouth, we're releasing tension. Inhale, come back. Hold for a moment. Open up wide. Exhale. Good. Last two. Inhale, open. Exhale. Last one. Inhale, open. Nice stretch through the chest, opening the lungs. And exhale, back to the center, round the back, open the back. Now, remember how we finish. Inhale, turn the palms to the sky, come up onto the toes, find that balance. And exhale through the mouth. Hands over the center, just below the navel. The knees are slightly bent. And we come back to that breath, deep, slow, abdominal breath. Good. Now let's take a nice wide open stance to the right once again. And this time again, we turn the toes out a little bit to about 45 degrees. And we'll place the hands just at the top of the thighs. So this is another one to help us twist the spine and get the movement of the energy through the spine. So as you inhale, look to the right. As you exhale, come down to the center, then inhale up to the other side and look behind. As you exhale through the mouth, come down to the center, then inhale up to the other side and we go back and forth, okay? So let's begin. We'll start by twisting to your right. So gentle bend in the knees. Inhale to the right, look behind. As you exhale, nice and slow, exhale through the mouth, back to the center, then inhale up to the other side, and look behind. Exhale through the mouth, down to the center, tuck the chin towards the chest, then inhale up. Good, exhale down to the center, chin towards the chest, then inhale up to the other side, and exhale, down to the center, nice and slow. And inhale up. So you can see very gentle movements, but very effective for warming the body. Now just move at your own rhythm, side to side. And you're massaging the internal organs. 
always working with the breath. And I'll be quiet for a moment and you just get into the flow side to side. Come back down to the center as you exhale when you're ready. Then inhale to stand up. Exhale, step the feet together, shoulder width apart. Remember how we finish. Inhale, up on the toes, hands turning up. Through the mouth, exhale down, nice and slow with control. One hand over the other, just below the navel. Knees are gently bent. Lift the pubic bone a little, sink the tailbone. And come back to that breath, deep, slow abdominal breathing. And as we close the eyes, we look within, always connecting to the internal experience. Qigong and yoga are really practices of going deeper inside of ourselves. can open the eyes. Two more movements we're going to do together. So first I'll demonstrate. Same thing. Feet shoulder width apart, toes forward. And we begin by bringing the hands, sliding them down the front of the legs, over the top of the feet, over the big toe. Then inhale all the way up. And we hold here for a moment. And as we hold the breath, we bring the hands back to the kidneys, holding the breath back to standing. Then exhale through the mouth, hands down the back of the legs, over the ankles, over the big toes. Then inhale, rise up. We hold here, hold the breath, hands to the kidneys, hold the breath, come back to center, exhale through the mouth. Same thing, slide the hands down the back of the legs, over the top of the feet, over the big toes, and we'll do that a few times, okay? So let's bring the hands here to start. Take a nice, big, relaxing breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. <sighs> Take one more inhale. As we exhale, slide the hands down the front of the legs, over the top of the feet, over the big toe. Then nice inhale up. Hold that breath in. Hands to the kidneys. Come back to standing, holding the breath. Now through the mouth, exhale. Slide the hands down the back of the legs, over the feet, over the big toe. Inhale, rise all the way up. Hold that breath in, hands to kidneys. Come back to standing while you hold the breath and through the mouth. Exhale, slide the hands down the back of the legs, over the top of the feet, big toes. Inhale, rise up. Hold for a moment, hands to kidneys. Come back to standing, through the mouth. Exhale down, nice and slow. Inhale, rise up. Hold that breath, hands to kidneys, come back to standing, and exhale down. Good, a few more times, inhale, rise up. Hold the breath in, hands to kidneys, keep holding that breath, back to center. Exhale through the mouth, slide the hands down the back of the legs. Over the toes, inhale, rise up. Hold the breath in, hands to kidneys, come back to standing. Exhale down. Try the last two on your own without me talking. We finish, come down. Now, as we inhale, rise those hands, turning them up to the sky onto the toes, and exhale down. Hands over the center, just below the navel. Bring your mind and breath down, just behind the navel. Where your mind goes, your energy flows. Let's open our eyes, 
finally getting warmer here. Now this last one is the strongest of all the movements. So once again, let's step that foot out to the right and turn the toes out to about 45 degrees. If you're feeling like you want to take it more gentle, you can keep the knees just bent a bit. If you're ready for the challenge, come all the way down. Now I'll show you first. What we're going to do is take a big inhale and as we exhale, we stretch one arm out with the arm bent and pull the other arm back like a fighter's position. And we tense all the muscles of the body, even the face, even the eyes, everything, your buttocks, your toes, and this creates blood flow. This is very strong. Hold that for a moment, then release. Collect energy, breathe in, and then squeeze everything. Keep squeezing, even eyes, then relax and inhale. Exhale. Relax. Inhale. We'll do that side to side, okay? Very strong. You're gonna be warm after this, I promise. All right, let's come down. Take a big inhale. Exhale, one arm forward, the other arm back. Squeeze every muscle tight. Relax, inhale. Open the hand, collect energy, and exhale. Hold, squeeze, strong eyes, strong body. Relax, inhale, collect energy. Hold and squeeze every muscle. Relax, inhale, collect energy. Hold and squeeze, relax, inhale, exhale. Squeeze every muscle nice and tight, relax, inhale. One more time to each side, squeeze, relax, inhale, collect. Last one, squeeze nice and strong, relax, inhale, collect. Step back, inhale, exhale, same finish, inhale up, exhale, hands over the center, gently bend the knees, sink the tailbone, close the eyes, slow the breath down, gentle, deep abdominal breath. We look within and feel the transformation as it's happening. Notice the physical sensations in the body. Can you feel the gentle vibration of the energy flowing? Notice your emotional state. How do you feel? And always aware of your mind and your thoughts. When the mind begins to move away, just come back to the breath. It's very simple. Let's open our eyes. Good, our last movement today. One more purification movement. So the feet are shoulder width apart. Gentle bend the knees. Now this time actually, I'm gonna show you and then we'll do it together of course, but I want you to keep the knees as straight as you can through this practice. And maybe from the side it's easier to see. We're gonna come up onto the toes, inhale up. Then through the mouth, let the heels come down hard. So the upper body stays relaxed. That vibration rises up through the body, releasing tension. So I inhale up and through the mouth. So I want to keep my knees straight so that the legs take that vibration and send it up into the body. Okay, we're going to do this seven times. Let's inhale up through the mouth. Exhale. Let the upper body be relaxed the whole time. Again, inhale, rise up. Good. Inhale, rise. Keep going, one more. Good, last three, inhale, rise. And two more. 
Last time, inhale up, hold for a moment. <sighs> Good, same finish as always. Inhale, rise up onto the toes. Exhale, energy down into the navel. And take a few calming breaths here as we close the eyes. And bring that mind and breath just behind the navel in front of the spine, connecting to this power center. Okay, let's open our eyes. So that's called the eight pieces of silk brocade. This is centuries old practice. It really works with the whole body. It's an amazing practice. If you do it, once you get used to it, you can do it in 20 minutes. It's a great way to start the day, really gets the energy flowing. It affects all the internal organs because we have energy channels that run throughout the entire body that connect to the organs. So when we move the hands, we move the arms, we move the head and the spine, we're also bringing health to the internal organs and getting that energy flowing. And the Chinese and yogis say that when the energy is flowing, that's when you have health. When things get stuck, that's when you have problems. So that's why every day we want to get that energy flowing. Now let's finish with just a few more breathing practices. So feet shoulder width apart, toes forward. Let's bring a very gentle hand, fist, like you're holding a bird. You don't want to hurt it, but you don't want to let it go. Now I'll show you first. We're going to inhale, open. So I lift the chest and I pull those elbows back lift the chin, and as I exhale, I bring the elbows together towards the navel, round the spine, chin to the chest. So we're opening the front and we're opening the back. The front side of the body is yin, the back side is yang, and we want to bring balance between yin and yang, between plus and minus charge of energy. It's all energy. So let's do it together. Ready? Inhale, open, and through the mouth, exhale. Bring those elbows towards the navel, really round the back, chin towards the chest. Good, inhale up, open, exhale. Bend the knees. So if you're not sure, look at me. You really wanna go deep into this rounding motion. Inhale, rise up, then exhale here. Open a little more. Inhale here, then exhale forward into the rounding, chin to the chest. Take a big inhale again, big exhale. Inhale all the way up and exhale a little bit deeper. Inhale here, exhale forward into the rounding of the back. Take another big inhale and full exhale. Inhale, rise up. Exhale a little deeper, inhale again. And exhale forward into the rounding. Take a big breath in and out. Good, now let's flow again. Inhale all the way up. Exhale, release into the fold forward. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, release. Try the last three on your own. Take your time. If you wanna hold here, you can. Feel that nice stretch, opening the lungs. And exhale forward, feel that opening in the back. Take your time. Good, now let's finish. We come down to the center when you're ready. Now we inhale, arms out to the sides. Collect the energy from above. As you exhale, shower that energy down through the crown of the head, down through the body, and back to the power center just below the navel. Take a few deep breaths here. Come back into that center. Only thing moving is your breath. And we store the energy here. So we have this powerful battery charged. And this gives us the power for life. Now we'll finish with what's called a centering movement. So very simple, you can even join me now. We bring the hand out, inhale up, 
Everything's gentle. Arm is bent a little, and we bring the hand into this type of position. Looks a little bit like a U shape. And we simply exhale down the center. So we're centering our energy. Then we'll turn that palm up, and we bring the other arm up. Inhale. Exhale, down the center. Let's begin. Inhale, up. Exhale. Inhale, rise up. Make sure there's a little bend in your knees. Good. A few more times. All around us is energy. So we're collecting the energy from around us. And we're exhaling down the center, coming into our center. This is powerful practice. Keep going. Center your body, your energy, your emotions, and your mind. Now let's close the eyes and do the last few rounds on your own. Take your time. And really connect to the flow of the energy all around you and within your own body. and slow. Let's do one more time on each side. Last round. And when you finish, bring the hands over the navel. Knees are gently bent as you lift the pubic bone in the front a little bit. Sink the tailbone down. Chin comes back just a bit to lengthen the back of the neck. And come back to that breath. As you inhale, the belly expands like a balloon. And as you exhale, the belly moves to the spine. We store all this beautiful energy that we created and collected just behind the navel in the energy center just in front of the spine. You can visualize a shining white light there. As you inhale, that shining energy center expands. And as you exhale, that energy condenses into a small pearl of light. Notice how you feel. Right, let's open our eyes. Step the feet together. Bring the hands in front of the heart. I'll wait till they go by so you can hear me. In yoga, we would say namaste. In Qigong, we say amitwafwa. So, Amitwafwa. It's essentially the same meaning. The divine light in me honors the divine light in you. So thank you for joining me this morning. That's a quick taste of one form of Qigong. There are many, many ways to do Qigong, just like there are yoga. So if you enjoy this practice, it's a beautiful, actually, combination that works really well with yoga, especially first thing in the morning because it's so gentle. It's a great way to wear, wake up and get the energy flowing. As a teacher, I love to combine yoga and Qigong in the same practice because there's so many things that go very well together. It's a moving meditation and it helps you relax, helps you feel energized, works with your physical, energetic, emotional, and mental body all at the same time.